What is the first thing you think of when you hear Google Translate? You know, whatever just popped into your head when I asked that question, that is probably going to be very different by the time that this video is finished. Yup, to get into the spirit of the holidays, because it's absolutely not related to the holidays, we're gonna be doing some really dumb stuff in Google Translate. Yay! Pretty much what we're gonna be trying to do is get Google Translate to spit out some of the weirdest sentences that you could ever imagine by inserting our own sentences into it. So how this is going to work is I asked you guys on Twitter to send me a bunch of sentences that were just as overly detailed or complicated as you guys wanted. And what I'm going to do is I'm gonna feed them into Google Translate in English. I'm gonna have Google Translate translate that English sentence into a different language, and then I'm gonna take that language's translation and bring it back into English and see how distorted the sentence gets. I've picked out five particular languages that I think are really obscure and nobody knows anything about. So that means that the translations are probably gonna be just as messed up. And I think it'll be pretty awesome to look at how these things end up. What am I saying? The five languages I picked out are Azerbaijani, Kurdish, Sesotho, Sinhala, and Yiddish. If I mispronounced any of those, that's very likely and I apologize, but I really don't care at this point. So we're just gonna kind of go through and see what the heck we come up with. I think it'll be a good time. Oh, and if you didn't understand anything that I explained, I totally understand, but just kind of bear with me here. This is gonna yield some really amazing results. I've done this before. It's the most entertaining way to spend any period of time. Just, you just have to see it. Do you ever think about how when we breathe, air goes in and out of our lungs? Bet I just blew your mind. Yeah, you really did. How do you think we are breathing air? I thought I bet. How do you think we're going to have a living? I suspect I'd betray myself. How do you think we will live? I doubt I'll give myself. How are we living? I doubt it. We're putting it in Yiddish gives the same thing. So I just want to go back to the fact that we started with the sentence, do you ever think about how when we breathe, air goes in and out of our lungs, but I just blew your mind. And we ended up with, how are we living? I doubt it. Excellent. This will be an interesting one. How much yeet could a yeet man yeet if a yeet man could yeet yeets? Why? We're already getting into some really strange things here. If only one writer was the only prophet, how could he have been able to walk alone? We completely lost yeet already. It's almost as if that word doesn't exist in other languages. Surprising. If only the writer was the only prophet, how could he only walk only? Now we have only in there four times instead of yeet in there about 50 times. We're already making progress. If only the writer was the only prophet, he could only walk. Now we're down to three onlys. If only the same writer could be the same writer, he only walked. If only the same writer could be the same writer, he just went. He just got up and left. He just, he just kind of got up, walked away, just had a ball, just decided to leave. You know, we're just like not having a good time. He's like, you know, I'm out. We're just gonna have a... <clears throat> Y'all ever just eat school food and profusely projectile vomit at 12 seconds later? No, Nick, this isn't what I meant by detailed. Y'all just eat the school food and harshly 12 seconds after the defect. <laughs> Y'all only eat food and work for 12 hours after defeating? Do you just eat food and work 12 hours after defeat? Because like, me too. I get it. Do you eat, eat and work for 12 hours after defeat? Excellent, this idea is already going places. This piece of information that has been bestowed upon your pupils today is indeed one of the most benevolent and oversaturated one-sentence paragraphs that has existed in your phenomenal and interesting life so far, so that's pretty necessary in my existing opinion. Unknown! This is why Twitter added 280 characters, just for this purpose. This is the only purpose. This information given to your students is one of the most friendly and saturated single sentences in your true and existing life so far that it is very important in my present opinion. Yup. Got that? This information is given to one of your students, one of the United Friends and Friends who is very honest and faithful in her life, as far as I think. Yeah. This information is provided by one of your students, one of the most trusted friends and friends of our life, as I think. This information is provided by your student, the most trusted friends and friends of my life. It's just the same thing in Yiddish again. Yiddish is so boring, jeez. So guys, we did it. We hit a quarter of a million subscribers. 
250,000 subscribers and still growing. The fact that we've reached this number in such a short amount of time is just phenomenal. I'm, I'm just amazed. Thank you all so much for supporting this channel. So guys, we did it. Reached a quarter million subscribers, reached 250,000 subscribers, and as soon as we reach this figure, it's so awesome in a short time, and I'm just surprised. Thank you very much for supporting this channel. All right, so this one's a little bit different. That's why we're going to reach 3 million million, reaching 250,000 users, and this is exactly what we're going to achieve in this way. Supporting this channel is very thankful. You all are very thankful, because that makes a lot of sense. We're going into some really strange places already. That is why we will reach 3 billion million, reaching 250,000 users, and this is what we will achieve in this way. Supporting this youth is very thankful. Very thankful! We will reach about 250 million people, and this is what we will do. Thanking for the support of this young girl. We will get about 250 million people, and this is what we will do. Thank you for supporting this young girl. How did we get to girl? There is absolutely nothing in the original passage that could possibly reflect the word girl coming into play at some point. How did we get here? Sentences are composed of words, which are composed of syllables, which consist of sounds produced by vibrations in your vocal cords producing sound waves that come out your oral area, which are affected by your lips, teeth, and the tip of your tongue. Woohoo! Oh boy. Sentences consist of syllables consisting of vibrations produced by your vocal tones that produce sound waves from the lips, your teeth, and your tongue. So we're not too far off yet, but I have a feeling this is going to spiral way out of bounds like really quickly. I was right! The books of the prisoners manufactured by vibrations that are used by voice of your own vocals dang and your voice by vote votes. What the heck? You got into dang? Dang's like an infection, right? And how we get into the books of the prisoners? Sentences became the books of the prisoners? What? Oh my, I, I don't like where this is going. This is scaring me a little bit. Prisoners are made up of vibrations used by the voice of your words, dangs, and your votes by votes. Prisoners are now abstract. Prisoners use the words of your words, dang, and voting. Predators use the words of your words, dang, and voting. Now we're into predators. Epic gamer moment! Alright, I actually, I think that one's gone far enough. I think we're good. Have you ever noticed that cookies are baked, but... Bakies? Have you ever noticed that cookies are baked, but bacon is cooked? You felt that baked bread was cooked, but the pork was cooked. Do you think eating was the meal? But was the pork clean? We gotta be sure that we have some sanitary pork in the house. We gotta have sanitary pork. If your pork isn't sanitary, what is it? it can't be pork. Oh my! Do you think eating was a meal? But was the carcass clean? How did we get to carcass? Are you kidding me? Is there some sort of translation to Sesotho that makes pork carcass? Because this is becoming unsettling. These languages are really ominous and it's like not my jam. Eating is a meal. We went from a sentence with carcass in it to a sentence with four words in it. That makes sense. If sentences could be one word long, what separates a sentence fragment from a sentence? I don't think that Google Translate is the best thing to ask about grammar considering what we've seen so far. If the sentences are longer than one word, what is the sentence separated by a sentence? If the sentence is longer than one, what is the sentence sent down by the sentence? If the sentence is longer than one, what is the sentence sent by the sentence? Seriously, that sounds like it could be some sort of like weird tongue twister. We've gone morbid again. If the punishment is more than one year, what is the punishment sent by the sentence? How did we get from sentence to punishment? I don't understand! Why does this keep on happening? We've had like carcass, we've had prisoners, now we have punishment! These stupid languages are like talking about death and stuff! I don't understand this! If the penalty is more than one year, what is the punishment sent by the sentence? Whew. I'm glad we're done with that one. My name is Alie and welcome back to another Fortnite video! Oh my god, why am I doing this to myself? My name is Haya and welcome another Fortnite video back! The name is mine AA and then another of the Fortnite video. The name is AA and one of Fortnite video clips. We're going into the morbid language, so I'm not really sure what's gonna come out of this. <laughs> what? what? AA 
and Fatnik are one of the video clips. <laughs> Ali's intro, and we have somehow come to the word fatnik. That's not even a word, but it's in there. Once again, Yiddish is just too accurate and it's boring. I don't want Yiddish to keep being accurate. I just gotta stop. The fitness crime pacer test is a multi stage aerobic capacity test that progressively gets more difficult as it continues. The 20 meter pacer test will begin in 30 seconds. Line up at the start. The running speed starts slowly but gets faster each minute. Fitness Gram Pacer Test is a very aerobic capacity test that is constantly increasingly difficult as it continues. The 20 meter crash test will begin in 30 seconds. Sort by start. The speed of the drive starts slower but faster every minute. The Pacer Test has become a crash test. The Fitness Gram Pacer Test is a very aerobic test that it continues to be continuously difficult. In the 30 test exam, the test will start 20 year test. Start with the start. Payment starts slowly but speed up every hour. 20 year test. Can I cancel my subscription to this service? Thank you! The Fitness Gram Pacer Trial is an aerobic test that is becoming increasingly difficult forever. For a test of 30 trials, the test will begin a 20 year test. Start with the start. The fee starts slowly, but it hurts every hour. Fritter Gamers is an aerobic test that is embarrassing eternity. A 20 year investigation is to be launched to investigate 30 investigations. Start inception. The fee is slow, but it hurts every hour. Fritter Gamers is an aerobic test that is embarrassing eternity. A 20 year investigation was launched to investigate 30 investigations. Start inception. The charge is slow, but it hurts every hour. Wow. So today we learned that Google Translate is broken, in case we didn't already know that. But now we have pure evidence to prove that Google Translate is indeed broken. I hope you enjoyed watching me painfully suffer as I read off every single horrible thing that you made me read and then watching it get transformed to some utter amalgamation of horrible things right in front of my eyes because of freaking Google Translate. Google Translate has scarred me for eternity. If you're willing to risk your sanity, I highly encourage you to try this. It's really interesting and also really painful. You know, just, just, just have a good time.